Oh, shit. Uh. Damn, they got lit up. Fish. People dropping their gear, dropping their guns. Damn, drown. You got to worry about... Uh, uh, you gotta worry about drowning, getting shot. Damn, he just drowned. Oh, damn! Died in his arms, literally. And it's like you ain't got no time to process that. You just gotta keep moving. Oh man, his arm blown off. Oh, he just walking around, pick. Oh man, damn! Jump in the water, just jump in. There you go. Holy shit! It's like, what made me sign up for this shit? Or they got selected in the draft. Damn, he said pretty much you either move or lose. Damn, it's like, how do you run past machine guns like that, though? Oh, damn. Y'all got to put him out of his misery. Oh. What are you guys? Oh, my man just got lit up. Oh, man. Oh. Oh shit. Damn. That was a lost cause like Yeesh. You got to be one of the most intense war scenes ever. Put in the comments if you know another movie that got a, a more intense war scene than this. Cause this shit is crazy. Yeesh. Okay, they made it to the to the beach line. Ah, oh, damn! My man's got face blown off, literally. Ah, oh, man, that radio's gone. Okay. I got it. We stopped the bleeding. We stopped the bleeding. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. Oh, that's old dude from, uh, young dude from Friends. And, uh, Ted. Ted. Yeah, crazy man's from Ted. Damn, he was young. Woo! Y'all not safe right there either. Holy shit, y'all just sitting there. Ooh, we got popped in the head. Oh, he lost it. Oh! Damn, he not that much of a lucky bastard. Damn. Oh my God. Ah. Uh. Ooh. Uh. They own it now. They're making progress. Get ready. Covering fire. Ooh. 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 Oh shit! That's Vin Diesel, y'all. Holy shit! I did not know Vin Diesel was in here. Oof, oof, that boy running. Ooh, holy shit. Captain, if your mother saw you do that, she'd be very upset. <laughs> I'm you were my mother. <laughs> you know, about to take their ass out. Woo! Oh my god, I'm That's one down. Shit. 
Oh, another one down. And they gonna shoot his ass all the way down the hill. Yeah, there y'all go. Damn, they so close. It's just like whack-a-mole. Ooh, caught all them out in the open. Damn. Sheesh. Don't shoot. Let him burn. Mm. It's like shooting fish in a barrel. Damn. Damn. Mm. Damn. Okay, like this is war. Oh, my man's been traveling. He said Africa. He been on it. Man. All those soldiers. It's crazy now because they don't even got this job. Like, they could just click and print a whole damn letter now. Something so damn simple. And Colonel got his arm blown off, too. Oh, shit. Is that Walter White? Oh, that is him. The three men are brothers, sir. I've just learned that this afternoon oh. my mother is going to be getting all three telegrams. Damn. That will suck. Ah, oh, damn. She about to get three letters at the same time. All oh, four of her sons went to the service. Brian Cranston. Man, I couldn't think of his damn name. But yeah, Brian Cranston. Man, I love him, man. His acting range is phenomenal. Yeah. Time to get those letters. Oh, there go pictures of her four boys right there. In the bottom right hand corner. Damn. Throughout swarms of German reinforcements all along our axis of advance, they're gonna be KIA too. Hmm. Damn. They stuck in a, a hard rock a, what is it? A rock in a hard place. This is a shit mission. Sincerely and respectfully, Abraham Lincoln. Oh, that was Abraham Lincoln. Who had to write that letter? Getting the hell out of there. Yes, yes sir. Yeesh. So, they about to send soldiers into another battle across enemy lines. To find one person. Like a damn needle in a haystack. I've got another one for you. Yes, sir. Oh, this shit. From the top. He got the mission to go save Private Ryan. They, like, they keep giving me bullshit. Thank you very much. Is that a souvenir? No, sir. Take your time, Cole. <laughs> oh, he had a wrong helmet on. <laughs> he grabbed the wrong helmet. He grabbed the German helmet. Yes. Hey, you want your head blown off, you fancy little fuck? <laughs> touch me with those little rat claws again. <laughs> Damn. <information. laughs> he was happy to see you, bro. I, where you're from. I mean, you got a mother. Sarge has got a mother. I mean, shit, I bet even the captain's got a mother. <laughs> well, maybe not the captain, but the rest of us got <laughs> <laughs> There's but to do it. James Ryan, I'm willing to lay down my life and the lives of my men, especially you, Ryden. <laughs> <laughs> He's good. I love him. Like, I'll follow this man into war any day. We got stopped by some intense rifle action from the eastward. The Germans have been reinforcing to Oh shit. All day. Is that a um... Uh Paul Giamatti? Yeah, that's definitely him.
Man, they got everybody in this movie. He's sitting here picking out apples and shit. Bro, what are you doing? Ooh, ooh. There's a wide open square with pretty good cover on the left. Show me. Sarge, yes. hold right here. Yes, sir. Now I better get that sniper. What's his name? Jackson? All get right. Jackson on it. This have a nice prize. 300 bucks last I heard. Company's got a pool. Five bucks gets you in. <laughs> they betting. Trying to figure out where the captain's from. There's a clue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so the captain don't talk about his personal life, huh? Like he all about the war. Like old... the school? Captain didn't go to school. They assembled him at OCS at a spare body parts of dead GI. <laughs> 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 attention to detail. I know exactly where it's from and exactly what he did. No, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Oh man. He about to get them kids killed. Captain, the decent thing to do is to at least take her down the road to the next town. We're not here to do the decent thing. We're here to follow fucking orders. Hey, what are you doing, Ben? Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, damn. Damn. I wouldn't venture out there, fellas. This sniper's got talent. Oh, damn. <laughs> okay, we're about to have a sniper fight. All right, here we go. Caparzo, stay still. Caparzo, don't listen. He on. He don't follow directions. Oh man. Oh my god, I fucking made. Let me not be ashamed. Ooh. Woo! Woo! Saw him a little too late. Damn, he shot him right in the eye. We got him. Stay down. Holy shit. I, that was a hell of a shot. I'm sorry, y'all. I got to rewind that shit. Ooh. Damn. My mans wasn't playing. He said he within one mile of Hitler. He had to take out Hitler with a decent line of sight. I believe his ass. And he did that shit in the rain, in the wind. Damn. That's why we can't take children. He's like, y'all need to, y'all need to listen. Shit. Time to find out the hard way. Jackson, search. Mellon, check the tower. Damn. And there go Vin Diesel. Right now, go. Trying to do the decent thing. Mm, mm, mm. Fuck on yeah, he like this whole mission is some bullshit. Ooh. Thunder! Flash! Come on in! Oh, that's they uh they code word. Get this goddamn hitchhiker out of my boot. Oh! Oh! Ish, ish. Damn! Oh, they was up upstairs. Damn, they got lucky. Can't be my brother's still in grammar school. Ah, oh, shit, they got the wrong Ryan. Damn. Dear Frederick Ryan, Minnesota. 
Ooh, well, shit, he lucky about that. At Paris, Paris should get Berlin. And then that big boat home. Damn, that's everything they got to do? I'm sure as hell could use you around here. Holy I shit. I understand what you're doing. I mean it. Find them. Get them home. Damn. So one guy out there who really understands it, understand the situation. Sometimes she'd come home early. I pretend to be asleep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I bet he wish he didn't do that shit now. It's my duty under your command to suggest that we wait until it gets up to a thousand subscribers. <laughs> what if we don't live that long? Damn, we just don't live that long. It is what it is. <laughs> Man, they busting back there. Look at that shit. Lighting up the sky. Look like lightning. One man. Damn. A lot of that going around. Fubar. Fubar. Bullshit. Fubar. Fucking bullshit. Y'all got that right. Hey, look up food bar in the German dictionary. There's no food bar in there. <laughs> Bitch. Don't mix them up, Jackson, all right? Keep them in your own fucking pile. How am I supposed to know who we got? Damn. Why don't you just shut up, Rodney? This Rodney? shit... Shit almost seems a little bit insensitive. I think I got a winner. What are you talking about? Just imagine. People going through your... Your fallen comrades dog tags like it was some bullshit. Man. Damn. Damn airboat watching. Put them back in there. Hmm. Yeah. The optics on it is bad. Ryan, anybody know Ryan? 101st Airborne? Ryan, you know a guy named Ryan? Call around with a Ryan from C Company? Yeah, well, bring him up here, would you? Hmm, that was easy. <laughs> Just ask around. Like, holy shit. Oh, my man's from... Remember the Titans. Speak up, sir. My hearing is not so good. German grenade went Comes and goes. The German grenade went up right by my head. Damn. Iowa, question mark. Do do you know him? D does he know him? It, read the message. Look. <laughs> yeah, of course I know him, sir. Does he know where he is? Where? In a bridge. That's the last I seen of him, great, sir. Great. Th thank, thank you. Right. Thank. Read, read, and thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Assemble on me. Up. Oh, they're going to Romel. Thank you. Makes any village on that river with an mm. intact bridge solid gold real estate. They looking at him shaking. Even though he's involuntarily shaking, they looking at him like, yo, you good, Captain? Damn. That shit is not inspiring. Confidence. Our objective, sir. Our objective is to win the war. Hmm. Okay, so they're like, yo, we supposed to just be finding Ryan. You want us to take out a machine gun. Oh, shit. Like, our mission is just to save Ryan, man. We ain't trying to do this extra shit, but... Flesh, you hook to the right. I'll go up to middle. Who's going left? Ooh, who want to go left? Who's going left? Like, we don't want to do this shit, boss. Base of fire. Oh, man. I ain't got a good feeling about this. They ain't got no good feeling. We can reach him and I wonder, are they doubting him because he was shaking his shit? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, yeah. They shouldn't be doing this shit. Oh. Holy shit! Holy moly. Man, he liked that action. Oh man. Uh-uh. 
Oh, he caught that shit and threw it back at him. Oh! Oh! Okay. Get the morphine out. Oh, fuck. Okay, so they had him stay back to watch the gear. Oh, shit. Oh, man, they met it, got hit. Damn. He got to try to walk him through. Uh, he got shot three times. Four times. He got four bullets in him. In the small of your back. They just spraying shit up. They. Oh, man. They don't know what the fuck they're doing. I could use, I could use a little more morphine. Damn, more morphine will kill him. Like, he gonna OD on morphine. Yeah, I knew it was over when he said the exit wound was the size of an acorn. Shit, he needs Vin Diesel's letter too. Uh, Caparza, he wrote Caparza's letter. And he al they already felt that this mission was unnecessary. Yeah, they about to beat the fuck out of him. Huh? Shut up with that filthy pig lad. Man. Mm, shit, he got shot and didn't even know it. Damn. And he can't do that shit in front of the man. They morale will be fucked. He's already in the toilet. And you know he probably beating himself up. Be like, man, he died under my command. Died under my watch. That's number 95 right there. It was the, it's hard to say, man. That probably was the best call, though. He's sitting here smoking with him. What the fuck? Yeah, he's like, yeah, you, your cigarette break down. Mm -mm -mm. He making it worse for himself the more he talk. I say, can you see? I say, oh, can shit. you see? Oh, oh I shit. Say. Prisoner, he surrendered. He surrendered, sir. He didn't really surrender. Y'all beat the shit out of him. He didn't just stop shooting. He, he was... Take him with us. Our guys will pick him up sooner or later. Oh, uh, no. Question is, would they have done the same shit? I guess that was the uh, decent thing to do, Captain. Yeah, they ain't gonna let him live this shit down. Little Jimmy's life is a little bit more important than two of our guys. But then again, we haven't found them yet, have we? Have we? Ooh. I feel him, though. I feel him. From Brooklyn, New York. Sorry. I'll spend the rest of my life in the stockade if I have to, but I'm done with this. I'm not gonna ask you again, soldier. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Shit. What, what, what's it up to? Wait, what is it? Uh, $300? Is that it? $300? Mm, he's I'm about to distract you. Ooh, damn. He's a school teacher. I teach English composition. Damn. Coach the baseball team in springtime. He was a regular ass dude. He's like, I'm just a normal man just like you. Yep, go ahead. Follow him. Yep, he in the same bullshit you in. Just carrying out orders.
Mm, yeah, fall in line. Don't leave your brothers behind. Right, he remind me of Ben Affleck. Like he could be like Ben Affleck's little brother or something. Up, oh, is it is it tank? Half track. What's that? Woo! Who's doing a shoot? Who's doing a shoot? Ooh! And that shit still pushing. Oof. Damn. Ooh, 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 ooh. Damn, it was like s seven of them. Six or seven of them. Ryan first of 506. Yeah, there we go. Ryan be third of 506. James Matt Damon. Ryan. Yes, sir. How'd you guess that? Mm, man, they like fuck yeah. He didn't save y'all lives. Brothers were killed in combat. Yeah, just get right to it. Which which one? All of them. All of them. Mm, all of them. I couldn't imagine hearing no shit like that. What's this all about? Ryan lost his brother. Which one? All of them. Damn. Look at them. They even like, that's fucked up. I have my orders too, sir. They don't include me abandoning my post. I understand that, but this changes things. I don't see that it does, sir. Mm, man, he want to stay. The chief of staff for the United States Army says it does. It doesn't make any sense, sir. Why? Why, me? Why do I deserve to go? Why not any of these guys? They all fought just as hard as me. Right? For real. I think she'll understand that. There's no way I'm leaving this bitch. Damn. He's like, I'm not about to abandon this post. Fuck that. That's a soldier for you right there. Well, that's a monkey wrench right there. He can't make him go. Yeah, I know they appreciate that shit. His brothers in arms. The world is taking a turn for the surreal. Clearly, but the question still stands. What are your orders? <laughs> what do you think? You don't want to know what I think. I say we drag his ass back so we can go. <laughs> shit, knock him out. Was the one decent thing we were able to pull out of this whole god awful shitty mess. Damn. That's what I was thinking. You're right. I didn't want to know what you're thinking. <laughs> we all earned the right to go home. Come on, brother. <laughs> I did not want to hear that shit. You pointed out what we got here a bunch of spit wads. So, how do we stop the tank? If we get it to commit, stop a tank with a spit wad. Mm. Come up with a better way to knock the tracks off a tank. I'm all ears. This is good. Now we're <laughs> <our> socks. <laughs> and not having socks is very uncomfortable. Shit. I hate to be out there with no socks. Listen, you're more than two feet away from me. That's not negotiable. So do they they need to keep the bridge so they forces can come by or are they trying to So the US wants this bridge to be available to them, I'm assuming. Yeah. Fucked up beyond all recognition. Right? Yeah, right. <laughs> Fucked up beyond all recognition. Fubar. <laughs> I didn't know that's what you were saying. <laughs> Fucked up beyond all recognition. <laughs> I mean, 
picture a girl who just took a nosedive from the ugly tree and <laughs> coming down. Damn, Alice was that ugly? <laughs> she jumps up and she tries to get running out of the barn, but she's still got this shirt over her head. She goes running right into the wall and knocks herself out. Oh, man. <laughs> so Sean's saying, what are you trying to hit me for? I just did you a favor. <laughs> <laughs> so this makes Dan more angry. Damn. That was a good story. Him and his brothers. Horse playing in the barn. That was it. That was the last... That was... Dan went off to basic the next day. That was the last night the four of us were together. Dude, dude, like, he don't realize he got more out of the captain than anybody else. Nobody else know about his wife or the rose bushes. <laughs> Mm, look, and his hand stopped shaking. Up, oh, here we go. Time to get to work. He sees Tiger tanks, two of them. Panzer tanks, two of them. Damn. Infantry. Damn. Four tanks. Rabbit, get on the rabbit. Yes, sir. All right, let's go. Let's go, Brooklyn. Let's go, Ryben. I don't need any luck, Sarge. I was born lucky. Up him. Hustle up. It's like, why they didn't have all the ammo and shit ready already? Here. They should have, he should have had that there already. Well, I guess they had to figure out which way they were coming from first. See if they took the bait. It's a ton of infantry, Captain. I don't know if they took the bait, though. Oh, took the bait. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's get it. Go time. You got any more of that? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> that shit had to be double gross. Infantry's moving to the left. Oh, man. Just went by with about 20 troops. Okay, so they didn't take the bait. They wanted them to come up that way, and they didn't. Woo! Damn, look at all them dudes. Go time. Ooh, man, that's an ambush for your ass. All right, here we go. Sticky bomb time. Here we go. Throw that bitch. Throw it. Dude, he's supposed to throw it. What the fuck was he doing? He didn't know what the fuck to do. He's supposed to throw it and stick. Ooh, go, 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 go. If I blow y'all asses up, go. Woo. Y'all lucky. All right, there you go. Yep, he on it. There we go. Light their ass up. Uh. There you go. There you go. That's how you supposed to do that shit. Oof. Okay, so he giving ammo and sending messages. Woo -hoo -hoo. Woo. Woo. That boy moving. Move. Go. Go. Shit. That sucks. Uh. Okay. Oh shit. Sniping they ass. Woo! Ooh. Ooh. Damn. Alright, Brooklyn. 
He was like, I'm protecting my one-way ticket home. Oof. Get off of me! Yeah, I'm fine too, Captain. <laughs> hey, what side? He's like, man, I can fight. Oh! Damn! Damn, they threw three of them in that! Holy shit. Oh, damn. Damn. Holy moly. Oh, man. Man, this shit's intense. They gotta get that 20 millimeter out. Oh, man, my man's moving. Oh! Ho, 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 shit. Damn. Oof, damn. There we go. Blessed be the Lord, my strength, which teaches my hands. All right, they got to take that tank out. There you go. Damn. Got his ass. Uh, there we go. Damn. My oh, man sniping their ass. Uh. He's like, he don't miss twice though. Oh shit. Oh no. Damn. There go Jackson. Fuck. And you got to keep it moving. Fuck. All right, let's go, Brooklyn. Let's go, Brooklyn. Whoo. Damn, he moving. Oh, shit. Yup, that ain't going to work. Oh, oh. They should just, they should just left all that damn ammo with them. Shit. All right, go, 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 go. I know he tired as fuck. Oh shit. Up him. That's up him. That's not up him. Shoot, shoot. There you go. Damn, they just came. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. He got caught in the throat. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Damn. Damn. Where you at, Brooklyn? Okay, good shit. They got that, that 22 out of commission. Good shit. Aw, uh, man, we haven't seen him the, this whole time. Up. Oh. Get some. Uh. There we go. Shit. Bro, you got to go upstairs and help your boy. Go. 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 No, no, no! Just can't show us. Let's just stop. Let's stop. Let's stop. Let's stop. Let's stop. Let's stop. Stop. No. No. Stop. Stop. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Got stabbed right in the heart. Damn. Ooh. Shoot. Oh, shit. Shoot. Holy fuck. Oh. oh no! Oh. oh fuck! Bro, you got a gun! Oh man! Damn! Uh, uh, uh. He looked.
looked at you like, you a coward. I ain't even got to kill you. And I know I'm sitting here like, man, you got to do what you got to do. You could have went in there. Being in war, you don't know what the fuck you'll really do. You do not know. I'm saying, man, I would have went in there. It's a possibility my ass didn't go in there. It's... I would hope I would have been having the courage to go in there, though. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, you got to be lucky you got Ryan right there. Know some shit like that. Oh, damn. There we go. Oh, oh. Get the fuck out of the way. Woo. Run. There we go. Let's go, Brooklyn. Reload. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You gotta sit there and play dead. Damn, they just practically running right over him. So I guess they want to protect the bridge, but at the same time, they don't want them to cross. So this is, ooh, shit. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh. oh, shit, he got shot again. Go, go. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. They all dying, man. You all right? I just got the wind knocked out. Get out of here! Take cover! We're gonna blow this bridge! Oh man, he got hit right in the lung, right in the back. Oof. Ooh, he is out of it. Ooh. He shell shocked. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, Mike gone. Come on, come on, Captain. Let's go. Oh, that's that son of a bitch that they let go. Ah, oh, that's the one that they let go. And look at him back, like he said, back in rotation. Mm, mm, mm. Fuck. Oh no, no, no. Mm -hmm. What the hell? Oh shit, reinforcements, finally. What the fuck? Y'all like five minutes too late. Oh man. Medic. Yeah. Like, Up him. Up him. He's like my friend. Oof. Yeah. He's like, I already gave your ass one chance. That's your first kill, this whole goddamn movie. Mm, mm, mm. Hang in there, Captain. Live. Go out and fucking live. Damn. Damn. Brooklyn is the only one that made it. That's him, the old man. He lived his life. Mm. Damn, that really looked like him. That really like that could be like uh, Matt Damon's dad or granddad or some shit. And that's his family. 
He he lived a a full life. Sometimes you just gotta hear that shit. You just gotta hear it. You just need to know. 1944. Man. That was amazing. Whew. Was that it? Yup. Man, there we have it. Hold on, shit. I gotta. That shit, wow. It's um. That was an amazing movie. Um, this boy Tom Hanks don't miss. It's uh. First off, I'm gonna talk about the movie. The movie itself, like that. This this movie was made in 1998. I saw this, I think I the first time I saw this, well, shit, the only time I saw this, I want to say I was in high school, uh, maybe 2001, I think a uh, freshman, I seen this in uh, one of my freshman's classes, um, I believe, but so really early on, that was, hell, 20 plus years ago, that was 22, 22, 23 years ago, so... Like, a lot of the stuff. And I, mean, I also remember, like, we watching this in class. So, it was, uh, you know, not really paying attention to most of it. You know, probably lollygagging and whatever. So, but I'm glad that as I'm older, this was, it felt like a new experience. But not only that, it's like something that I feel like I can appreciate with everything that's going on. That everything that's happened in the last 30 years. But not only that, like... Like, what's going on in the world now? Like, the war overseas and, you know, and even all the other wars and battles and everything that's been going on. And it's like, we do take gr for granted, especially, like, right now with us over here, that we're not really going through that. Like, we don't live that life. We're not in that battle. Like, if you don't, if no one's talking about it, you won't think about it. You know, you go about your day, you working your you're working your job, you're taking care of your family, you doing YouTube reactions. But when you really sit and think about what people are going through, even it doesn't even have to be here, you know, in the United States. Everything that's going on in Israel or, you know, the the war that's going on over there, it's like this movies is the closest thing besides actual footage and doc documentaries like this is the closest thing that we have you know for those people who are not in the service to connect with that you know and it's and it could be rough like i remember seeing some i, I don't want to even get into it but you know these movies do a really great job i feel painting the picture as far as you know, what people are going through, what what a country is going through, you know, and, and these movies, whatever message that they're sending is very, very powerful. Whether if you agree with it, whether if you don't, media has been used to influence or, you know, or influence in a positive or negative way where there's, you know, propaganda, whatever it may be. My point is, like, Shit, movies like this really, really hit hard, you know, and, you know, Tom Hanks did do a great performance, but I, I think, when, like, when I watch these movies, I kind of try to, like, put myself in the position or, like, put myself, like, if I was there, how would I react or, you know, and... And it's like, for me, I would love to do as much as I can. But then at the same time, I wouldn't want to do anything. Like, I couldn't imagine myself going over there, you know, leaving my kids behind. So, you know, I got two young kids. And and for those people who can't leave or for those people who are, are that's in this shit, you know, you're just trying to do whatever you can to take care of your family. 
and the whole sh the whole sh anyway Anyway, this movie was amazing. It was great. Um, excuse me. I mean, but it, it do get you thinking about a lot, especially, like I said, with everything that's going on. But movies like this really can help, you know, connect you to your humanity, help you look at stuff different, make you want to do more. So. Uh, Tom Hanks, everyone involved in this movie, thank you. People who uh, suggested this movie, thank you. Thank you for voting for this movie. It was great. Thank you for taking the time. Shit. Let me, I gotta get it out. All right, here we go. Thank you, guys. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Um, remember, if you guys want to support, consider becoming a member. Um, you can see, I don't know how much I'm going to edit this out. I don't know what I'm going to do, but if you want to see everything unedited, make sure you become a member. If you want to help suggest more movies, um, pick exactly what I want to watch, you know, consider becoming a member. But thank you guys. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. And I catch you guys on the next reaction. I'm stopping it right there. I'll catch y'all later. Peace. Shit. All right, y'all. I know I ended it. I took a couple minutes to compose myself because I really, really wanted to talk a little bit more about the movie. So I hit play again. This movie was amazing. You know, I'm pretty sure this is probably one of uh, Tom Hanks' top performances, but it was really great to see a lot of the other actors um matt damon uh paul giamatti vin diesel i did not know vin diesel was in this movie like so it was really good to see a lot of these actors when they were younger um you know in this film this was like a really star-studded cast um i love the action you know the scenes of everything was 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 incredible the the the, the very first scene of all the other battles was amazing i love the choreography of everything you 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 really felt like you was there, you know, especially for this to be in 1998 where special effects wasn't a huge thing. They did a damn good job. So uh, hats off to the director, hats off to the script, hats off to everyone who project, you know, portrayed their characters. Uh, they did a really great job bringing you in, making you feel like you was a part of this war. So, you know, um, so that's that. Um, also some things to see is like, it all depends on how your perspective is. It's like, Hey, the, you know, the Germans have their way of beliefs, which is understandable. We have ours, but it's just two different sides on their own perspectives. And they all fighting for what they believe in. Um, but it was good to see, um, I, th I think they did a really great job with the character development of all of the soldiers. You know, you got a little bit of information here and there to help you connect with them. So you feel their struggle, their pain or their death or whatever that's happening to them, you are, you're able to gravitate to them. You know, my man's who never seen combat by the end of the movie, he ended up killing his first guy, but he thought he was doing the first decent thing by letting the German soldier go. He thought it was the right thing to do, but then comes to find out He's back in circ, you know, back in circulation. He's going back to killing us, you know, and he enjoyed it. As you see, he, you know, he smiled when he when he shot Captain Miller. Like he was like, "This is what I live for," and for you to spare his life, you would think like maybe have a change of heart. But then you see that my man's come back with the vengeance. So it was it was it was cool to see how little moments at the beginning came full circle. Um, my man's from New York. Um, I can't think of his name, but my man's from New York, from Brooklyn, you know, you felt his anger. You felt 
how he was. You can understand why he felt the way he felt. We're about to risk our lives for this one guy, you know, who we don't know, who could be an asshole or, or could be a douchebag or whatever. You know, you could connect with him. Like, I wouldn't want to put my life on the line for one guy because we're about to send him home in the middle of a war. You know, it felt like a foobar mission, you know. So I really, really, really enjoyed, you know, getting a little pieces of information of everybody. You know, Vin Diesel's death. You know, you, we connected with him a little bit. He tried to do the decent, decent thing. Uh, my man's uh, the medic. You know, we was able to connect with him about his mother. You know, we finally get a little bit of information as far as from Captain Miller. You know, with... You know, him finally telling us what he did before the war. You know, he was a regular guy. He was a school teacher. And to know that he was human, where all of his comrades always put him above. Like, he, he's not a human being. He was put together in a, in a U.S. lab because he's just a killing machine. He's a beast. He's a monster. But we was able to connect with him. You know, on a personal level, like, dude, my man's just a regular guy who teaches English and has a wife at home that does gardening. You know, so they did a really, really, really great job painting the picture, um, bringing you into all the characters. And then, you know, and then Private Ryan at the end, you know, he made his stand like, look, I know my brothers died, but I'm not about to sit here and leave my other brothers. You know, that was admirable. That part right there was almost a tearjerker, like. Like, he's standing up for what he feels is right, you know. And then, you know, following through with his promise on earning his life at the end, you got to live it. Don't let the people who died, you know, sacrifice their life, essentially, die in vain. So, it was an amazing movie. I'm pretty sure that there are stories out that like that in real life. So, again, shout out to the soldiers. I respect you guys. Thank you for your service. For any people who ever been in any part of branch of, of our military and is, and is doing that sacrifice, even even other people that's making that sacrifice for their safety, officers, whoever, thank you. You know, people in hospitals, you know, in the medical field, everything. Thank you guys. All right. I didn't want to end the movie like the, I mean, the reaction the way I did, but um, I'm going to keep it in there. But I at least wanted to discuss the actual movie. <laughs> I just needed to take a break. All right. With that being said, thanks again. I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. And I'll catch you guys on the next reaction. Until then, peace. All right. I feel a little bit better about that.